Reports have surfaced stating that Jermail Charlo, WBC champion, was involved in some kind of domestic violence dispute. Stay tuned. Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chat channel donations, the Venmo donations, and the Patreon family we work in now it seems that there is an issue going on a lot of people hit me to it i had no idea of this but people told me and espn is reporting and i'm gonna read it junior middleweight world titleist jermel charlo has been indicted on one felony count of domestic violence stemming from an alleged incident with his girlfriend in may according to dallas court records here's my story and then there's a whole article i'm gonna read some pool quotes title junior middleweight champ Jermail charlo charged with domestic violence less than a month before charlo Jermail defended his junior middleweight world title in june he was arrested and charged with one felony count of domestic violence he faces his first hearing in the case august 1st according to dallas county police records right on may 18th charlo was booked into dallas county jail at 1 43 p.m for allegedly trying to choke his then girlfriend jasmine charlo 28 posted a twenty thousand dollar bond and was released he faces one felony charge of assault on a family or house member with intent to impede circulation according to dallas county police deputy raul according to the grand jury indictment issued on june 19 charlo allegedly squeezed olison's neck and forced her against the fence floor and railing on or about may 17th he also allegedly pulled her hair charlo committed the said offense by intentionally knowingly and recklessly impending olison's normal breathing and circulation of blood by applying pressure to her throat and neck and by blocking her nose and mouth the indictment read charlo denies the charges jermel is not guilty and is looking forward to his day in court dallas attorney mike howard representing charlo said and for the full article link in the description jamal charlo on his verified account says you can't believe everything you hear so my thoughts are very brief because i don't know what happened i wasn't there and it's not my business what happened i'm just going off of the report you guys heard it i don't know what happened but it obviously it could be bad it's potentially going to be bad if he gets in trouble over this he's a wbc champion so a lot can happen with that but sometimes when you're in the limelight people make stuff up so i'm not sure i don't know what happened you guys can leave comments and, and talk about it or if you know more detail than me then feel free to have at it but definitely something that raises people's eyebrow and he's gonna have to get through them. so we'll see what happens next i'll just report what's going on let me know what you guys think drop your thoughts in the comment section make sure you smash the like button as always hey comment and subscribe to next videos egos on it so if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel you can show your appreciation by going to the paypal donate button or the youtube support button and you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video much more to come thank you guys for your support boxing ego the future of boxing